Hello, everybody. We are playing uh, Shenmun. Shenmun. Shenmune. Oh. She and Mui. Uh, I've never played this game before. Steve has, apparently. I played a little bit. Uh, is this the incident? Oh, look at how smooth it is. Look at how boxy that car is. It's like it's made by Tesla. Oh. Do you see that? No. You, you haven't seen the new Tesla car? No, I have not. All right, we'll have to we'll have to look at it later. Why does it look like a like a literal rectangle? It, I s swear to God, when I first saw the picture, I had no context. I thought it was just uh like someone made a really shitty low poly model uh -huh. of a car. Yeah, and I was like, why is this on here? That's really stupid. Why is Facebook showing me this? Uh huh. And then later, Jen was like, Hey, did you see the new Tesla truck? And I'm like, No, I'll have to check it out later. And then everyone started talking about it. I'm like, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I think I have seen the new Tesla truck. Oh no. It was made in 1993 by Dreamcast, wasn't it? So the best is someone took a picture of the current of the Tesla car next to the the current Tomb Raider. Uh huh. And then they took a picture of the new Tesla truck next to the old like PlayStation <laughs> 2 Tomb Raider. Yeah. It's just funny. Oh, it's good. Ah! Sorry, he scared me. Oh, he must be cold. His teeth are chattering. Fuxan. Whoa! Don't do that! <laughs> oh, I love, like, listening to the audio for this. Yeah. Because you could tell that they didn't redo the audio. Yeah. Yeah. They it's... just redid all the everything else. Yep. Oh, is he? Who is this? It's Shang Tsung. Ah, uh, Shang Tsung, or the actor who portrays Shang Tsung. <laughs> I like the, the idea that the actor just kind of goes off the deep end and thinks he's Shang Tsung. <laughs> he's just running around killing people. He's like, no, I must gather fighters for Mortal Kombat. Give there me was the like, mirror. Dude, that was a fucking movie based on a video game. Give me the mirror so I can open a portal to Outlands. What then the my master you... Shao Kahn will come through, and the Mortal Kombat shall begin again. The best is he's like, I can transform into anyone. Then he just grabs like a cup of ice and throws it at you and goes, See, I am Sub-Zero. <laughs> <laughs> or he sits there and he's just like, Haha, now I will transform into Liu Kang. And he like holds his hand up to his face, and you see a Sharpie marker come out, and he's just like, <laughs> <laughs> Later on, he just like, like, now I am Scorpion. And he just throws scorpions at you, though. <laughs> like, nothing to do with the character. And he's just like, ah. And they're like, oh, fuck. And he's like, animality. <laughs> he just throws a bunch of scorpions at it. And he's like, get over there. <laughs> like, he just gets shit wrong all the time. Like, he doesn't actually know it very well. Oh. I Come love closer it. to me! <laughs> I require you to be closer! Wait! Oh shit. The mirror. It's it's buried under the cherry tree. Man, you know, I've been watching a lot of anime recently. Yeah. And uh as you know, I like my anime to be subbed, not dubbed. Yep. I never thought the day would come when I would listen to Japanese and hear it as English. Oh, yeah? Like, instantly translated in my head. Well, that's cool. Yeah. That's the name of the man you killed in I mean, aren't you hearing that, too? No. No? What does no, it sound like to you? It's kind of like the Swedish chef. Oh! Like Interesting. Like, I can kind of pick out some words. Uh-huh, uh-huh. But, yeah, most of it's just kind of gibberish to me. Uh... You know they call the Swedish chef the Polish chef in Sweden? Yes. I did and he know says that. different words. Yeah. Um, like instead of bork bork bork, he says hurdy gurdy or something like yeah. that. Oh, it's so strange. I, I like to imagine that somewhere out there in one translation, they actually just full on Englished him. Oh, it's just like, it's the American chef. And he comes out and like, howdy, y'all. Let's make cowboy steaks. <laughs> <laughs> it's like just a <laughs> shitty translation. <laughs> we are going to make the hamburger. 
Howdy, Real howdy, um... howdy, 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 <laughs> as he's cooking. <laughs> Real American ha hamburger. <laughs> cool. What's up? That's chill. So fly, as he's like pan frying something. Do you want some freedom fries? <laughs> I love my freedom. Such an American thing. We only have freedom. <laughs> and obese children. <laughs> oh. Turns out freedom is the currency of America. <laughs> and obesity. The fatter you are, the well, see, more powerful you are in America. You buy obesity with freedom, Tom. No. Oh, I forgot about that. <laughs> okay, let's let's not go there. You know what? I'm having a good night. I don't want to get. I don't want to talk about that. No, no father, no. Ah. Oh, no. How did he die? He got kicked in the stomach. You know, what would be great is mm. a game. I want a game. So like like Shenmue, but more realistic, right? How, so it's, how is it more realistic? Well, like. He just got his ass kicked by like some kung fu master, right? Uh -huh. That's not exactly a realistic scenario. But like, yeah, it, it just is. starts off the game's just kind of like super average, super normal, uh -huh. um, and then like halfway through the game, shit just starts getting kind of weird, and then a little bit after that, it just goes fucking full on. So JoJo Star Adventure bananas crazy. So what you're saying is. Is you want to have a video game that is the equivalent to the movie Sunshine. Sure. Have you ever seen Sunshine? No, you've talked about it a bunch. Okay, so... Uh, hashtag spoiler warnings for a movie that's like probably 11 years old now. And nobody's ever heard of it. Except for the select handful that have. Yeah. And proclaim it as one of the best movies ever. So, it starts off as a phenomenal sci-fi movie. Like... The movie premise is, is that the sun is dying, a thing that a lot of scientists... The star, not like, yeah, like a person. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Like, the star that is the center of our galaxy is dying, uh, which I believe is something that is actually happening. Uh, I mean... But, like, on a very, very slow level. So the sun is... Will eventually burn through all its fuel, but the reality yeah. is, is it's going to go supernova first. Yeah. Which will engulf the Earth, so, you know... We will not be around for that period of time unless we yeah. move from Earth. So it's at the point right before the sun is going supernova. And the way that they're going to restart the sun is basically feeding it a whole bunch of fuel. Okay. To prevent it from going supernova. So basically what they have is they have this ship and it's just filled with like explosives pretty oh. much. The They're police just... is one one zero. <gasps> Fire is one one nine. Oh, one seven seven is for forecast. Oh wait, it's backwards. Or actually, it's the correct way. So we can call the dojo. We can call. Uh, I don't Itosan. I'm not comfortable with the way these numbers are written. <sighs> Why? Because it's four digits dash two next digits. line. Oh, two yeah. digits dash three digits. I, I feel you on that. Uh, I don't I don't get it either. But uh, I don't. okay, so this is something that I love. Like yeah. I played like four minutes of this game. Uh huh. Uh -huh Not uh -huh. even a joke. Uh, I love the fact that it has the journal, and the journal literally tells you what happened and like kind of what you need to do. Like it's like the starts of like uh like a quest tracker. Right. But it's done in like a, a very like it sells the 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 fantasy that you're like. On this quest yeah. kind of thing. Um, anyways, so... Oh, oh, tank controls. Yeah, it's like... Who so, made this game? Uh, Konami? No. No. I don't who know. made this game? I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna so, find out. anyways... <clears throat> um, the they, they basically are traveling with a bomb. <clears throat> and they're trying to get it to the sun, detach it, and, like, launch the bomb with this giant, like... Like thermal time. shielding around it, right? <clears throat> to have it enter into the, the the sun, make it a certain distance in, and then detonate this super bomb to create a bunch of plasma to feed into the sun. It's pretty impressive to have a, a bomb that can withstand the temperature of the sun. Yeah, exactly. Oh, you got some fucking months, Huns. <gasps> yeah, and it starts off like super, super like sci-fi, where they're like all walking around and they're dealing with like. The psychosis that comes with being in space for a prolonged period, even yep, yep. though there's like a team of eight people, 
And then they run into this other ship and then they're like, huh, I wonder what's in this other ship. And so they go to look at it and they enter inside and they find that the entire crew has died for mysterious reasons because they're the crew from the original one that was supposed to go to the, the, the sun before and blow yeah. it up. And so they're the second crew and they're like, oh, we could use both ships and send off both bombs so that way we can create even more fuel for the sun. Super sun. Yeah. And they go back to their ship and weird shit starts happening. Okay. And they're like, what the fuck is happening? Like, oh, somebody just died. All the plants got fried. And then they find out that there is the captain from the original ship who snuck on board while they were investigating the other ship. And he's become okay? like possessed by the power of the sun okay like his entire body oh, is a hundred percent crispy charcoaly bacony burned all right and he's running around with superhuman power and like like he's fucking going nuts and causing everything to like die and he's like murdering people he's like the sun is dying and i was as a worshiper of the sun have to protect it and like it goes off the fucking deep end. Like he's like has superpowers, and he's like burning alive. Like his skin is molten, and all right. Like he like touches a flower and it lights on fire or some shit. And like it goes fucking off the deep end. And I just remembered, it's like John Heater or uh, it's that one actor who played the Scarecrow from the Batman movies. Uh, Cillian Murphy. Yeah. So it has Cillian Murphy in it. Okay. And like he's like going through like where they have the bomb and the bomb looks like a large version of the Hellraiser cube. Oh god, okay. And like he's like I'll just set off the bomb early and then it'll the gravity of the sun will pull in all the plasma or some shit like that cuz like he ejects it from the ship to try to separate himself from the crazy like sun god demon dude right right and he fails and the sun god demon dude is like chasing him down this infinite labyrinth that is the the bomb and oh wait how do i run again it's like r left trigger ah it's right trigger and like he's like it, it's it's an amazing movie until you get to like the last half hour and it just turns into the most batshit crazy nonsense ever yeah all right so we talked to the guy, Fukusan, uh, and he talked about how he'd never seen the, chi the the Asian guy before. Wow. And is that really how we're going to define him as the Asian guy? I mean, might as well. Whatever. Okay. I mean, I'm Asian. You're not, but it's how okay. How do you know? Maybe I am Asian. Do Maybe you, ever, you are. You think? Maybe you are. Do you I don't that? know. All right. So I have no clue <clears throat> what to do. Okay. Let's see here. Uh, Ine-san gave $500. Oh, she leaves $500 on the shoe cabinet for you every day. Okay. Go to the dojo and talk to Fukusan. I'll get revenge for my father. Ask around to see if anybody saw men wearing black that day. You gonna ask around here? Yeah, I mean, this is ask around, so might as well. Like, they're our neighbor, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, look at that guy. Look at him in his weird, puffy, yellow, black bumblebee jacket. Hey, bro. Hey, bro. Did they hit something? Oh. I want to ask you something. Oh, okay, I do. Yeah. What is it? That day. Whoa! I like how he's like this. Like that he's day? that uh, day. Did you see anybody in my yard? I see. That the day of the incident. Any idea of who may have seen them? Hmm. How about Mishima-san or Kondo-san? Those women just might know something. You know, I like how his mouth says one thing and his eyes are dead. Yeah. <laughs> Holy shit. <laughs> shit. You, you just... Why don't you speak to Kondo-san or Mishima-san? They might know something. And deep down inside, you look in his eyes and you just see a small version of him in there. He's just like, kill me. Let kill me, Ryo. Let me free. The demons control me. That day. That day. Uh. Uh, the day of the incident. Oh my God! Her voice. You know what she reminds me of? Uh, Mr. Mosquito. Hard for you. Okay. Oh, the Yamada family. They're going out today. 
Did you see? You should go in and suck the blood out of their of their family. Go for the bald spot or whatever. You remember that game? Kind of. Oh, we need to record that next. Oh God. I do we? Yes. Yes, we do. I want to play that game again because it is so ridiculous. Also, we might have to cut an entire episode, but you know. Yeah, yeah. Whoa! Why is this kid yelling at his mother? I don't think. I think hey. they're siblings. I don't think it's. Oh. What are you doing? Jesus. Hmm. That's some good voice acting. <laughs> oh, that was good, stimulating conversation. Some other time, okay? Let's play soccer! I'm so glad that, that was something that could happen. Hmm, right? That really added to the immersion. I mean... I'm so immersed uh, right now. I'm far more immersed in this than I was in, uh... <clears throat> Skyrim. <gasps> Perhaps they're out. What? You have to knock? Yeah. What is this? It's a realistic RPG. Oh, no. A cutscene. Hmm. I can tell. Is that the music from Chrono Trigger? It sounded like it. You got a kitten in there? Show me your. Never mind. You know what? I'm no, not gonna go no, there. No, 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 no. We're gonna just cut this out. Sure. Okay. <clears throat> this is kind of adorable. How this little neighborhood, like everybody, is so close with each other. Because this is something that you would never get where, like, we live. Yeah. Where, like, you walk around and you just, like, you're like, Oh, what's up, Frank? How you doing? <gasps> no! It looks like her, the, the clasps for her ponytails are just untextured. It kind of does, doesn't it? Like, it's that, like, kind of, like, you can tell it is textured, uh -huh. but the color they chose is, like, this color that's usually used for untextured objects. It's the, uh, it's the obnoxious super pink color. Right. So that way, whenever you have testers running through, they're like, there's something wrong here. Yeah. It's the, no one would, no one would actually use this color. That's when we find out that this is actually a bug, like it actually isn't textured. <laughs> and there's like super late in production, like, you know what, fuck it, they won't just, notice. Just, just, just it's fine, turn into it's fine. It. Turn into the swerve. Yeah. Just put a little dot on it, we're good. Yeah. Oh no. No. Think she's hungry? Hmm. I think she is. I have an idea. I'll go steal from the gods. Okay. They don't need it. They've got enough. I mean, that's what he's doing right now. The gods only care about souls. Uh, okay. So, you want to know what's funny? Huh? I know this only because I, um watched an anime about it so if you look in front of the 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 shrine it's a shrine to a fox deity yeah which are the servants of the god and the servants of the gods the foxes like fried tofu okay so you leave offerings of fried tofu to them so that way they'll bring your prayers to the gods because they'll take favor upon you Gotcha. So if I took the fried tofu, I would assume that the deities would get mad or something would happen, you know? Maybe. Maybe not. I don't know how mystical this game gets, but... I mean, it's got Shang Tsung in it. Uh, well, but he's also the actor who portrayed Shang Tsung, not actual Shang Tsung. I'm the actor who played Shang Tsung. I mean, I'm Shang Tsung. I just transformed into the actor that who portrayed me. It's a clever disguise, don't you think? <laughs> not, not really. No, no, th th it's very obvious. Whatever happened to that actor? Uh, he's actually done a bunch of stuff. Huh, I, I mean, I know he's done a bunch of stuff, but I haven't seen oh. him since then. Let's see, let's see what he's done. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. You could take good care of that cat. Mortal Kombat. That unblinking Oof. stare Oof. is, uh... Good Ooh, disturbing. God. What? Just like that fucking, that stare. Jesus. Okay, this is a one lane street. Yeah. Holy balls. I think. And it also has a blind turn in there. Let's see. Goodness gracious. What have you been in? 
Hey, it's the ladies. Oh, Mishima-san. Oh, hello. There's a little kitty there. You should get that kitty for the other kitty. That day of the incident. Did you see that day dressed in black suits? Of the incident. Black suits? No. Well, he was in a movie called Sky Sharks. That sounds amazing. Oh, he actually does. He actually did the voice of Shang Tsung in Mortal Kombat 11. Mmm. Uh, he was in. Wow, he did three episodes of freaking Man in High Castle. That's kind of cool. Uh, he was in Lost in Space. Oh yeah, yeah. The the TV series on uh, oh, Netflix. Oh, I don't remember him. Yeah, I do. I don't. Uh, let's see, he was in Star Wars Rebels. Um, Apparently, he did a voice in World of Warcraft Legion. Oh, listen to this voice. Kondo-san, the day of the incident, did you see any men in black suits? The day of the incident? You mean the day it thundered, right? The day it thundered, right? <laughs> oh my God! <laughs> oh, that is a voice I have not heard in a while. Jesus. Let's see, he was in Kubo and the Two Strings. Nice, nice. He was apparently in uh, Overwatch Dragons. Who, who would he be? He was the narrator. Oh, that would make sense. Kinda. Yeah. Wait, okay, I totally did not get what they said. I need to visit... Whoa. Yamagishi-san. Like how that dude's just like, mm, Would you get yeah. the fuck out of the way, please? Are you Yamagishi-san? Oh, he just despawned. Alright, cool. Excuse me. Yes. Oh. What's this name, plate say? I'm illiterate. I'm just it too is, goddamn old. Does it? Oh, he did the voice of Haihachi in Tekken. House, but see, my eyesight is bad, so. Oh. I'll look for it. Wait for me in that park up ahead. Uh, You're see. so kind. He was in a couple episodes Thank of Hawaii Five O. So okay, he's just been doing things that I don't watch. Yeah, I mean, he's done a ton of shit. Cool, 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 cool. cool. I'm happy to hear that. Oh, he was in Heroes. There's a character named the Swordsmith. Oh, he was in two episodes of that. Oh, something else I don't watch. He was in Teen Titans: Trouble in Tokyo. That Memoirs makes sense. of a Geisha. That makes sense. He was okay. apparently in Electra. How do we? How do we read these? Oh, like seriously. Use your eyes. Okay, so it was the Yamatos. Wasn't uh, wasn't there a button? Yeah, you can like zoom in. There you go. Nishida. Okay. Where do the Yamamotos live anyway? Where do the Yamamotos live anyway? Well, he was in <laughs> Planet of the Apes and Pearl Harbor. Oh, okay. Walker, Texas Ranger. Yamagishi. What? That's the word that he just. Oh wait, that's the person I'm looking for. That's why I remember that re name. 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 Name, name. Oh, he's apparently in Stargate SG-1. Hajima. He was in Sabrina the Teenage Witch. Oh, wow. He's done some things. He was in Babylon 5. Ah, God. Oh, oh, shit, he was in Mortal Kombat. What? I know, right? Wait, the guy who played Shang Tsung was in Mortal Kombat? Right? Yeah, Whoa. he played a character named Shang Tsung. Oh, I know Shang Tsung. Yeah. I went to school with him. Sean Tsung. What's up, Sean? What's up, Sean Tsung? Uh, that's not how you say my name. Whatever, Sean. You have a good one, bro. Stop fucking around, Sean. <laughs> what up, Sean? Hirano. That is not the one we're looking for. All right. But somehow we've missed the most important part of this game. Yeah? Uh, the... Uh, the toy machine. I don't have money. Yes, you do. Where? You got like $10,000. Where? Your mom gave you a bunch of money. It's not my mom. There, there, there. It's Ine-san. That's not my mom. Capsules. Yes. Each, huh? Yes. Do it. All right. Do it. All right. See? $10,000. It's not $10,000. That's like $100. Or it's like a thousand. Oh yeah. Oh yes. Yeah, it's a hundred bucks. Oh. oh. Wow, so disappointed sounding. Oh. 
You should I got buy, a dice. Buy the Sanic ones. But I want Virtua Fighter. No, Sanic. Have you uh, seen the new Sanic trailer, by the way? No. Oh, we should watch after this. All it right, looks fine. surprisingly good now, actually. I'm actually really we'll impressed. Quit. Yeah, I guess this is. Oh, so this game was made by Sega? Yeah. That's who made it, by the way. Sega. Good, good, good job there, Steve. I love these. I yeah. love these. This is this is how far I got in the game, by the way. I did Wait. this for like an hour. I literally blew all my money buying these. <laughs> And then I just stopped playing. Oh my goodness. So you've never really played this game. No. What is that? Huh? Is that supposed to be fucking knuckles rolled into a ball? <laughs> <laughs> Please tell me it's ball knuckles. Uh, nope. It's just ball one. Oh, okay. Cool. Gotcha, gotcha, too. Yeah, you should get another. Do All it. All right. We're going to buy another one. Yes. Yes. We need the Sanic. Come on. Give us a good oh, one. It's a blue one. Oh, is oh that, it is, looks is, blue. Is that? <gasps> no. Oh, it's mighty. Hey, what's this? What? Who is that? Mighty the Armadillo. I don't know. Who. He's one. Oh, it's Espio. It's Espio. You fucking It's nerd. Espio the, <laughs> the chameleon. Oh, it's mighty. It's mighty the something or another. It was Espio. Yes. Oh. Yes, buy more. It looks oh, red. Oh, no. It's another fucking Espio. What? What? This again? Dupes. We don't Where's want the no dupe dupes? protection? Yeah, seriously. This is bullshit. God. Right. At least Overwatch it. doesn't do this. Yeah, get more. Get more. Yes. Right, buying another one. Oh god, yes. It makes me so happy. What do ooh, we have? Ooh, ooh, oh, it's oh, green. Oh, it looks like tails. It's, it's not. This is cool. What the fuck is that? Who is that? I have no clue. Is that I've Daffy's never... Asian cousin? <laughs> Jesus. Bean! Bean! It's apparently a character named Bean. I, I literally have no idea where that All character right. came from. One more, and then we're going to move on. Yeah, okay. Whatever you say. Just one more. Whatever you say, Captain. Wait. I'm sorry. Mm. Oh. It's just... <gasps> yes! It's Knuckles. I know this. Knuckles! Yay! We got him! Okay, I'm That's sorry. That's why I blew all my money was trying to get Knuckles. <laughs> Do you like Knuckles? Yeah. All right, hold on. We're buying one more just to show you something. Watch the entire machine. It just sunk a little bit. Yeah. It literally has a Oh my God, did we get Sonic? What? Hey, what's this? We got Sonic! Oh my God, I can't believe your luck. Oh my God. Chili dogs. <laughs> Gotta go fast. I'm so cool. Wait, it's Sonic, Sonic one. one. That means there's more Maybe Sonics. We get another. Maybe we should get another no. Tom. No, Tom. No. Mind. All right, get the virtual fire then. We're gonna, we're gonna go. We're gonna go Game help store. Grandma. We're gonna no. go help Grandma. No. Tom. Right, grandma, where are you, Grandma? Tom. What if Grandma wants fucking uh, capsule toys? <laughs> well, then Grandma's gonna have to buy them herself. Oh my god getting dizzy well that's your problem it's not mine can you not do that into people's ears how about that no huh? no I'm brewing alchemy what how are you brewing alchemy fuck off explain to me how you are brewing alchemy oh this is a nice I'm an part. alchemist no I don't think you are full metal have you found it, have you found it? No, not yet. Wait what? Today, we did. We totally did. Was around here. I'm sorry to oh my you. goodness. Come on, Grams. I know why. You I have to knock why. at the door. You gotta knock at the door, I bet. No, I found the plate, but I didn't hit the A button to interact with it to be like, mm. oh, here they are. Quite literally in front of. So it's, it's literally that scenario where you read something, but don't actually register it in your brain. I've done that way too many times. And I get in trouble for it. Oh, good. Come on. Come on. Come on. Do it. All right. Come on, Rio. There we go. Just need to get a little bit in front. Yamamoto. That's it. Guess I'll go get that lady. I like how everything he says is just this, like, really flat American voice but then as soon as he reads the name he's like he just suddenly gets a slight accent well, I mean that's what I kind of do very much 
It's like I'll sit there and I'll talk to them and be like, yeah, I'd like, uh, like two tacos and a chili relleno. And they'll be like, sure thing. And I'll be like, gracias. Thank you. And I'll full on, like, articulate and everything. Gracias, Gracias, senor. Gracias, senor. There are so few helpful young people these days. But look at that ass. Just I would flat do terrible die. things to that boy. If I was only 20 years younger, I would go oh, to buy town. Coke. Buy a Jet Cola. On that flat and tight ass of his. Look at how flat it is. Oh, Tom, we finished the quest. We should reward ourselves by buying more capsule toys. Oh, okay, cool. Can you actually buy a soda? Uh, one Jet Cola, please. Oh. 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 Ooh. Oh, Fruda. Fruda. Are you gonna, get, you gonna get Jet Cola or Jet Soda? Mm. That's like Pepsi versus Coke. Well, we already know the answer. I like Pepsi the best. Ha <laughs> ha, fooled you, you got the wrong one. No! Suck it, nerd. Why is it yellow? Huh? Oh, huh? oh Dippin' Dots! You won, Tom. Wait, What did I win? I have no clue, maybe more capsule toys. <laughs> I apparently have really good luck in this game so far. Yeah. It's because you left the tofu for the fox. Oh. That fox is like, dude, that tofu was so good. So dank. Good. Oh, good. What? Don't throw the can away. Yeah, you Winning gotta, can. Winning can. I, I don't think, know what you do with it. I think you're it. right. I think I did get, like, good luck by leaving the fried tofu. Maybe. Hey, Grandma. Excuse me. I fucking won. baby boy, yo. It, they're one all more like time, that. Please? They're all like that. Oh, how can I help you, baby boy? Rio? The Wait. Of that incident, did you see any men dressed in black suits? I don't have the time to fool with looking at men. I see. I see. Your face is wrinkled beyond belief. You again. With me. Every day it's the same old routine. Can you hand her the can? I, I want to say I can, but I don't know how. Uh, uh, I didn't mean to do that. Sure you didn't. All right, let's see. Maybe, uh, story items? Uh, yeah. Story items, winning can. Uh, What? Use these commands. Use A or Y. Oh, there we go. This, please. Okay, little deal. Try your luck. Oh. 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 You got a scorpion! <laughs> oh. Too bad. Oh. What? Oh, you can't win them all, you know. So wait, you have to get a winning can and then you have to win again? Yeah. Some rigged ass bullshit. And I want more. You gonna buy some? I'm gonna go buy myself another jet soda, please, and thank you. Or are you gonna buy a collapsal toy? I think I'm gonna buy myself another another soda. Or, or on this. Or you can buy a collapsal soda. Or I can get myself a Fruda, Fruda grape. Not the Fruda. Give me that grape drink. Grape drink. Oh, it's not a wiener. Oh. He's just a grape drink. Just another grape drink. Still oh, like it. It's so good. I don't know, Steve. I'm having a feeling that the uh, that the capsule toy inside the machine is a far better reward than the capsule toy inside the the, the toy over there. I don't know what the hell you're ah, talking good. about. Ah, good. Unfortunately, I have a crippling addiction to soda. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got to go talk to Amazaki-san or something like that. Let's do that guy's bike. Hey, bro. That's a nice bike you got there. Who's this? Yamagishi-san. Uh, that's not who we're looking for, I don't think. I believe it is. Are you sure? I need to visit uh, Yamagishi-san. Almost got hit by the black car. Uh, I don't know, I man. Them. Yeah? What? Oh, they're right there. Yeah, my guess she's on. Oh, it's you, no. Oh, it's you, you Jesus. son of a bitch. Back. Yes, it's much better. 
All right. Oh my no. goodness. It looks like whatever you would take, like <laughs> silly putty, and smash it down on the newspaper, and then pull it across your face. <laughs> <laughs> Why did you have to smash on the newspaper before pulling it across your face? Because if you put silly putty on the newspaper, it will take off the ink. Oh, I see. You're you're replacing your face with the ink face. Yes, okay. exactly. I, for whatever reason, when you said that the first time, I thought you were saying you you got the ink on it, and then the ink side you pushed against your oh, face. Oh no 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 like, no! I'm what's sorry. What's the benefit of that? Yeah, I'm sorry. No, you like put like the non ink sign on your face and you're just like And to make matters worse, I fell over. So I never had the chance. Oh you're okay. I'm glad to hear you're okay, but I'm still so mad at you. Dubai T went towards Dubu Dubu Ita. Maybe Pebble who worked there saw it. All right, and we'll All head right. over to uh, Dubito's next time. Bye. See you.